Joey Logano, he, he's ready. He's won the last three races. This is the Sprint Cup Eliminator 8 now at Martinsville. 66 laps to go. Matt Kenseth and Brad Keselowski get into each other and both spin out. Kurt Busch takes the damage as well. Rick. Yeah, and he had nowhere to go. And Kurt had an outstanding race up to this point. So there's a replay of it right there. Kenseth and Keselowski collide. Both are hit hard and both will go into the garage. Bush would finish 34th. Keselowski would finish 32nd. Then 47 laps to go. We knew because what happened at Kansas, Joey Logano, Matt Kenseth, and then you see this, Ricky. Yeah, so drivers have a long memory. And uh, anytime they feel like something was taken from them, eventually they're going to take it back. Kyle Busch, uh, he, he told Logano, uh, you got to watch your back. And you can see Kenseth right there. Uh, totally obvious to me. Obvious for everybody. <laughs> <laughs> so there you see Logano. He would finish 37th, and Kenseth would finish 38th. So that ends Logano's streak of winning races at three. He didn't win a fourth to try to tie Jimmy Johnson, who was the last one to do it. So then seven laps to go. Jeff Gordon, the man you said who was going to win today, there's Gordon. He's a master at Martinsville. Came into the race with eight wins. Avoids a casualty here with Sam Horspin, uh, Hornish spinning. How about a green-white checker? Then on the restart, Gordon and Jamie McMurray. Neck and neck. And Gordon able to gain the lead coming into the final lap. So then on the final lap, Gordon. This is good racing. This is how Ricky used to race back in the day. You remember that far back? Yeah, I do. Good memory. Holds off McMurray and gets the victory. So Gordon secures his spot in the championship four at Homestead. And Gordon snaps a 39 race winless streak. He's excited. He's ecstatic. Yeah, yeah, we won. Uh, but Ricky, you said Jeff Gordon was going to win, and, and you, you got it right. 